I'm feeling much it's a blur. So I'm still trying to get to that zone that uh, I have control of time rather than time is controlling me. Usually I start my mornings slow. So uh, as of this moment, everything is still at war. That blur and that clarity that I'm trying to establish. I think it's ano na, the perfect day, the perfect time to get married. When the night has come and the land is dark and the moon is the only light we'll see no i won't be afraid oh i won't be afraid just as long as you stand stand by me so darling I guess I realized that I was ready um, to marry Isabel. Uh, at the tail end of the year, the two years that we were together. I guess I found myself in, again, a blur. This blur right now is deja vu. That I, I returned to that moment, tas nasabi ko na, shucks. Both of these moments from now and that moment that I said that I'm ready for Isabel are quite the same. All the sacrifices that he made, um, everything he went through just to prove that, you know, he was trying to change, he was trying to be the best version of himself. The amount of courage it took him to admit that, I think, you know, that's the moment that I was like, okay, this guy is doing everything he can just for me. I guess I, get, I felt that feeling again when I was, uh, when Isabel and I were to meet again for the first time after two years. I saw that he never stopped trying to um, be the person he wanted to be for me. <laughs> Not just for me, but you know, for himself, for his family. For his friends as well. And as I was walking to her, I felt that I wasn't in control of time again. You know, I wasn't in control of my emotions again. Isabel made it so comfortable that when she looked at me for the first time again, I was like, I'm gonna come home and marry her. I'm gonna come home, ask for her hand, and I'll do my best. But yeah, I don't think I've ever found the right words to describe it. 
um, I guess the best word to describe it is that it would be like indescribable in a way. I guess it's it's a moment of gratitude to see Isabel walk that time. When I see her, she's coming to me. It's gonna be perfect. I guess I see that moment when the doors open uh, in a sense that it's a culmination of all the years that I've known her. I guess right now, just thinking about that moment, my heart is pounding. I don't know exactly how I'll react. Uh, of course, I know tears will roll down. For me, I feel like once the doors open and I see him like down the aisle, I think I'll be feeling a little more calm. I think seeing him will calm me down a little more, um, get me a little excited and teary-eyed. Um, but yeah, I think it will calm me down. I think, yeah, it's gonna be more of seeing flashbacks while she takes her steps towards me on all the ups, all the downs. I'm gonna be embracing that moment na I'm seeing her, she's coming to me, and we will finally get married after 11 years. If you were to ask me how much I love Isabel, and my honest answer is, I love her more than myself. Everything is elegant, colorful and porcelain. I want to feel this way again. I guess the one thing that scares me the most is losing Isabel.